Very special to play um, with being their only six previous Welsh Welshmen that have played in the Ryder Cup. So yeah, it's very special. You know, something I'll treasure for the rest of my life. You know, it's the biggest stage, isn't it? Something you know, I've always wanted to play a Ryder Cup. So you know, let this be. You know, the first of many. You know, I'd like to keep going and play more and more. You always dream of it when you're a kid. You're moving up the, the ladder as amateur golf, trying to compete at all different levels. You do that, you turn pro, and you work your way up as a pro. It's been a long, uh, a long journey, but uh, eventually, you know, we're here, so it's very satisfying. It's taken my whole career to get to this point, so it's a great reward at the end of a couple of seasons of really good golf. And it's, you know, it's a team environment, something I love to play in as a pro, and it's match play, so it'll be a really good, fun week. You know, playing the Ryder Cup is very important for me, um, but something I want to use as another stepping stone and move on from there. It's a hole in one for Jimmy Donaldson. Nice to see Jamie playing. He's played really consistently over the last few years, and uh, nice to see a Welshman in there. You know, I think it's been quite a while, probably since uh, was it since Pricey at uh, the Belfry. <laughs> And he beat Phil Mickelson, so uh, you know, hopefully Jamie can play as well as Phil did. And I would say to Jamie, just go out there. You're going to be nervous on the first tee, but it'll soon go. Enjoy it. Enjoy the experience, because you might not play in a Ryder Cup again. Enjoy them noises, the crowd, and, and that experience of, of being in the, in the Ryder Cup team. You're going to be nervous in the first tee, of course. You're going to be nervous a lot of the, uh, the, the rounds that you're playing in. Um, but it's part and parcel of all the work and the practice that you do to get into the team. He's a, just a great guy. He's 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 uh, he's fun. He's great to be around. He's going to be great for the team atmosphere. Aside from his golf, but the big thing that Jamie's going to bring to the party is the fact that he burst over the line. I mean, he's made a huge amount, of, earned a huge amount of points to make this team. He's made this team quite comfortable in the end, and he went out in the second last counting event and won it in order to put himself in the team. Psychologically, that puts him in a very strong position to play his first Ryder Cup. So I've no doubts that he'll hit the ground running when he gets to Glen Eagles. From winning in Czech was huge, and then playing decent in Switzerland, and then you know if I can win again going into the Ryder Cup, then you absolutely can't be more ready. The good thing is that the form has been good of late, so you know whatever happens, I'll be going into the Ryder Cup on good form. Go, Go and be lucky. Yo, terrific shot. He's believing in himself. He was always a fantastic player. He was uh, maybe never really had the belief, and in the last couple of years, the belief has grown and starting to win golf tournaments on a regular basis. And he'll be a, a great addition to this team. I played with Jamie about four years ago in Barbados, and you know he was a solid player. But over the last you know three or four years, he's really turned himself into a great player. His swing is more consistent, and obviously puts very well as well. So he's got the ball. He's got the putting stroke, and. Let's hope he does it in uh, Glen Eagles this time. That's what I believe is going to happen, and that's what I'd like to happen, obviously. But um, like you say, you can only play as well as you can. The whole team has to play well for us to win, and I'm sure that's what everyone's set out to do. Bring it on. <laughs>